Oh, hello there. Mr. Cherry, I would like to tell you something about our school's name. Oh, what's happened? Did some hooligan change the school's name again? No, I've received word from the GoAnimate community that GoAnimate's name has been changed to beyond. So? So we'll have to change the school's name from GoAnimate Middle School to Beyond Middle School so that people who walk by don't get confused. Oh, that's strange. Why would they change the name of the online animating software we know and love? I don't know. We'll have an assembly explaining this right after lunch, okay? I need to sort out my exam schedules for next week, so I'll be in the staff room if you need me. Okay. My lunch break starts in like two minutes, anyway. Beyond. What a strange name. Oh, I'm hungry. They have chicken and peas today, which I like, but I honestly don't mind what food they have if they're sold out. I guess I'll check anyway. My mini slaves, er, uh, students, shouldn't notice that I'll be gone for about two minutes. Ah, I knew this invisibility cloak would work. We heard everything without them noticing us. I know, Dora. Let me see if the coast's clear in the principal's office. It should be, anyway. All right, K.I.U., the coast's clear. Let's do the unthinkable challenge that you thought up with. What? Pranking this school into thinking there's a demon on the intercom? Yes, K.I.U., it's our sweet revenge for everything that the teachers put us through, including the punishments. Got it. Right, let's do this. Okay, Dora. Be afraid, scrubs. I am a demon risen up from the gates of hell. I have kidnapped one of your masters, Mr. Cherry. I have brought a friend with me who looks like a kid who's four. Yeah, I am the demon's friend that doesn't resemble a 3x3 three three grid of circles from a rage-inducing game. I have also kidnapped the second one of your masters. I may not know her name, but she can't spell happen correctly. And we are here to make your life a living nightmare in every way possible, and we'll start by eating your souls. MMM. They taste good. Be prepared to live the rest of all your lives without a soul, as they'll be in our bellies. You can't escape your fate, scrubs. <laughs> That's right. You all will die today, emmates. <laughs> and we'll blame it all on a certain go animate legend who's uploaded this video on this channel. Or so evil. Ha <laughs> ha Damn, if I had pronounced lives correctly with that demonic voice, then that would have been solid. I know. Let's get back to class, quickly. We don't want to get caught. So, you've been the demons all this time, even saying that we've been kidnapped. How could you do this to our beautiful school? We didn't even have time to get our lunches, because of your stupid antics such as this one. Ooh, you're in big trouble now. Now, Dora and Krilly, I want both of you to march back to your classes, grab your disgusting bags, and wait for me in this hall. Now, we've got a bone to pick with both of you. Have you got cotton in your ears? Move it, you deaf scrubs. Don't worry, students and staff. That was a false alarm. Dora and Krilly have done this, and I'll be punished when I'm through with them. Whoa! Stop moving you crazy back! Yo, that is close. Now, Dora and Krilly, both of you are gonna write everything that just happened whilst you two were playing around in the office. And listen here, scrubs, don't freaking lie. Because if you do, ooh hoo hoo, a horrible fate awaits you, and this horrible fate involves your parents, capiche? Now, now start right. writing. Yay, Dora. What is it? K.I.U. Did you think that they had any proof? Um, no. How are we gonna get out of this predicament? I'm scared. I don't know, Dora. No proof. No proof. That's it. We can write whatever we want on this stupid paper. Ah, uh, okay. I see where this is going. Hey, hey, hey. Are you two done writing? Yes. yes. Then give them to us. Right, Dora, let's see what you've wrote. It better not be a lie.
All right, Kyle, it's your turn to state everything you've done today. If there's even a single lie, then I'll have both yours and Dora's rear ends cut off and mounted over our fireplace. Well, at least you didn't roughly copy each other's statement. Anyway, I need to talk to both of you in my office, right now. Oh, and Dora, I saw your bug bag slide across the floor. Don't let anyone trip over it, or else. Marty, Dora, according to what you wrote on your paper, it says that you were trying to find your monkey, and you needed to ask for permission to use the bathroom in the process. You also heard the voice and you were scared, so you attempted to flee back to your class. After that, you said you did nothing wrong. And Kayo, your paper says that you tried to make an animation using Go Animate, which is now beyond, but your computer committed Sudoku and you had to leave to calm down, because your video didn't save. After that, you said that you heard the same demonic voice and you, along with Dora, were aware of the intercom announcement. Is your statement true? Do you swear on it? And, and is, is this, this your, your final, final answer? answer? Yes, I'm telling the truth. I swear on this. And, and this, this is, is my final, final answer. answer. Are you absolutely sure that this is your final answer? You'd realize that this has all been recorded for security purposes, right? Wait, recorded. What do you mean? Well, scrubs, look to your right. You better be prepared for an eternity of hell when your parents are through with you, scrubs. Yep, since this video started, MJ here has recorded everything that's happened in the office. So, we'll see what anti chat 2 nuisance has caused. Let's watch the fade right now. Right, let's do this. Okay, Dora. Be afraid, scrubs. I am a demon risen up from the gates of hell. I have kidnapped one of your masters, Mr. Cherry. I have brought a friend with me who looks like a kid who's four. Yeah, I am the demon's friend that doesn't resemble a 3x3 grid of circles from a rage-inducing game. I have also kidnapped the second one of your masters. I may not know her name, but she can't spell heaven directly. And we are here to make your life a living nightmare in every way possible, and we'll start eyeing your souls. MMM, they taste good. Be prepared to live the rest of all your lives without a soul, as they'll be in our bellies. You can't escape your fate, scrubs. <laughs> That's right, you all will die today, emmets. <laughs> And we'll blame it all on a certain Go Animate legend who's uploaded this video on his channel, or so evil. Haha. <laughs> what did you just say, Dora? What did you just say? Me, that's it. Your punishment's now doubled. I can't believe you would say such a cruel thing to this young chap. What's wrong with you? You both clearly believe in the devil. But regardless, do you have anything else to say about your disgusting foul mouths of eyes and myths? Say whatever you want. It's going up on YouTube and that's final. Fuck, uh, okay. You just caught us. We give in. We write about what we wrote down the paper. We didn't mean any harm and we were scared. If you don't want us to die, don't call our parents. Holy heck. Words can't describe how sorry we are. We regret everything. You better keep regretting, scrubs. I'm calling your parents right freaking now to come over and talk to all of us and you too. You stupid Todd Rogers wannabes. Hello? These are stories of Kaylee's parents. Yep, they're called so many bad days. One of them was lying to the principal and vice principal. They're in big, big, big trouble. What? She'll be punished when I hear more about her antics, and I'll be there shortly. What? I can't believe you would do such a thing. Ooh, he's crossed the line big time. I'll be there as soon as I can. Good. FYI, they liked all of this for pranking the school on the damn intercom, and there will be another conference for the 2,791,990 second time, as usual. The big trouble makers. I will see all of you soon. Your parents are coming here to make your life a living hell. What the hell do you have to say to them for yourselves? Okay, now that we all know everything that's happened today with these two nuisances, we'll now talk about punishments that will make them suffer indefinitely. To be honest with you two, you probably would have escaped this horrible fate if you didn't lie. Would have been a warning and nothing else. No, actually, this would have happened regardless. You've caused so many bad deeds. Just take a look at all your grounding videos, especially this one. Smooth Jazz was gonna be deployed to help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, but you're dirty liars, so you blew it and worsened the problem by 995,254 levels. Dora and Kaylee, your pain and suffering since A.K.A. Punishments include a regular talk with the counselor every day, including weekends for 10 lifetimes. A referral for every single time you've been grounded in your life from all videos, including deleted ones and this one. A suspension until my subscription on Go Animate for schools expires, which is on the 31st March 2019. A detention for three months after the day that it will last before school, during school, after school, and during the night and back to before school till your time's up. 63 punishment days back to back, and for Dora, it's 126. And 10 repeats for all these punishments for every unnecessary alert in all Go Animate videos ever. If anyone's watching this after my subscription's ended, then you're suspended for 2,147,483,647 seconds from the moment this video ends. Letters, words, sentences, and even paragraphs can't describe the true disappointment of how we picture you. I think you two need to go to a mental hospital. And Kyle, I thought you were gonna understand what actions we were gonna take if we didn't believe you and your girlfriend, Dora. That's twice you've lied to us. Wow, I can't believe you right now. I honestly don't know why I let you two escape Brian's dungeon. I should have left you two in there to rot and go death. You've lost our trust and faith in all of us, and probably your parents' trust and faith too. That's right. She really is Dora the Troublemaker. She's lost all our trust ever since she killed Gina and disrespected her freaking funeral. I still can't believe she's done that. Shit, I've lost her trust in me, too. Shit, I've given me five and I'm ready to see what I've done. You know what I've done? I've Oye, se es mega fake report caro cara fake grave anche. P. A. Ansia like 30 speaking errors on it. And you will find a bunk of fuss no because of this. I agree with everyone. In fact, Kano has been held back from every day in school except this one in the city. Just look at all the Kano gets held back videos. Don't forget, Doris, you shot a fluttering girl a few years ago because there's a stupid video somewhere on YouTube showing that and I had to ground him for an insanely long time just because of that. We really need to take our son to the damn mental hospital. He's lost our trust ever since he done that. And he'll be sorry he was ever born. Did you hear everyone's response? You too. You don't deserve to be trusted anymore, scrubs. 
Hey, to the parents and grandparents of Dora, and to the parents of Kyle, the stupid kid who's four, that grows some more each day and likes exploring. Here's some sign-up papers to an honesty therapist at the hospital, the military school, and the U.S. Navy. You're also going to summer camp for troubled teens, regardless of age. Conference is now adjourned, and this video will end without the ending logo. Get out of here and go home now. Get out, get out, get out, out, out. Dora, we can't believe you, you're the principal, and the principal, and got suspended for a really, really long time. Well, then don't worry, don't say a word, please. Joe, Amy, Vicky, Joe, Amy, Amy, Abby. You're so old, 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 Blast the joy, it's bacon's icon bar over the nerve and earworms and orange is last and fast and s- Kayla, how freaking throw you lie to the damn principal and got suspended in school? What the hell's wrong with you? I can't believe you're disgusting behavior right now, it's putrid. Me either. Are you on Canvas or something? Um, no. Am I grounded? Oh, what do you think? Scrub, let me take a random number out of my head and say, oh, I don't know, 700,000. With the word years next to it? Yeah, that sounds right. As in, you're grounded for 700,000 years. Scrub, go to your room now. I'm also calling the town to take you to the mental hospital and honesty therapist. Why me? Why, 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 why,